Welcome to the Defeating Epilepsy Foundation YouTube channel. In this presentation, we will discuss what primidone is, the history of primidone, how primidone works, side effects, and risks. Make sure to like our videos and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell to be notified of future videos. Please click on our donate link in the description section below and donate today. Your donation helps us to make a difference for those battling epilepsy. We appreciate your support. This presentation is for educational purposes only. Any questions you have regarding your current medication, changes, or any level of treatment, please contact your physician for any medical advice. The Defeating Epilepsy Foundation provides only educational resources and will not provide any medical advice when it comes to medication or treatment. According to PubChem, primidone is an aromatic anticonvulsant used to treat complex, partial, and generalized seizures. Primidone is also known as mycelin. Primidone is an analog of phenobarbital with anti-epileptic property. Primidone is a first-generation barbiturate type, anti-epileptic medication developed to commonly treat partial and generalized seizures. Primidone was developed by Carrington and U. Bogue in 1949. On March 8, 1954, the FDA endorsed primidone for the treatment of epilepsy. Due to the marketing of other anticonvulsants such as carbamazepine, phenytoin, lamotrigine, and vigabatrin, the use of primidone to treat epilepsy has greatly decreased. However, it is used in situations where other treatments may be resisted. Primidone has been efficient in treating patients suffering from idiopathic post-traumatic epilepsy or those suffering from epilepsy due to traumatic brain injury. Although the mechanism of action is not fully known, primidone probably exerts its action similar to phenobarbital via activation of gamma aminobutyric acid, a receptor ionophore complex, which leads to prolonged and increased frequency of opening of the chloride channel within the receptor complex. The result is an alteration in the electrical activity of the nerve cell membrane causing hyperpolarization and prevention of partial and tonic-clonic seizures. In addition, this agent is partially metabolized to phenobarbital, which may also contribute to its anti-seizure properties. Primidone can cause the following side effects, excessive tiredness, dizziness, difficulty coordinating movements, nausea, vomiting, loss of appetite, double vision, uncontrollable eye movements, decrease in sexual ability. Contact your doctor if you experience the following. Rash. Other conditions can affect the use of primidone. Tell your doctor if you are dealing with the following conditions. Asthma, emphysema, chronic lung disease, history of depression, hyperactivity, kidney disease, liver disease, or porphyria. In conclusion, according to PubChem, primidone is an aromatic anticonvulsant used to treat complex, partial, and generalized seizures. Primidone is a first-generation barbiturate type anti-epileptic medication developed to commonly treat partial and generalized seizures. Although the mechanism of action is not fully known, primidone probably exerts its actions similar to phenobarbital via activation of gamma aminobutyric acid, a receptor ionophore complex, which leads to prolonged and increased frequency of opening of the chloride channel within the receptor complex. Talk to your doctor about any side effects you are experiencing. Do not make any changes to your medication without consulting with your doctor first. To learn more about primidone, please check out the resources used in the presentation today. 
Please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on our social media pages. We would love to hear from you. Leave a comment below or email us at info at defeatingepilepsy.org. Thank you for your support and together we will defeat epilepsy. Check out our other great videos and subscribe today. You have the power to defeat epilepsy.